Hi, everyone. Thank you for coming for, to this year's fourth annual 60 Second Lectures presented by the Honors Program. Uh, this year, it's a little bit extra special. Um, we're dedicating this year's 60 Second Lectures to one of our uh, fellow classmates that passed away last week, Nathan Orsini. Um, as I'm sure many of you know, he was very active a member of the Honors Program and a great friend to many of us here. Um, this is largely to thank him for the great contribution that he's made to the Honors Program and the university as a whole and to all of our lives that he's touched. Uh, he did love the Honors Program and these kind of events. He always was coming out to all the different programs that the school was putting on. So to dedicate this, I'm going to start off with a 60 second lecture of my own to begin the evening. So, just a fair warning, um, he was always better with rules than I was, so I'm going over 60 seconds, as I'm sure many of the professors after me will be doing. Uh, so often we think about someone who is truly remarkable, and we think about someone who's achieved something great in their life, someone like Neil Armstrong, who was the first man on the moon, and their remarkableness is defined by that one moment in that one action. And that's not always the case for everybody. For Nathan, his remarkableness wasn't defined by the fact that he had such a positive attitude in the face of such a horrible disease. It was the fact that he was able to have this positive attitude throughout his entire life. And when he was here, he was able to touch so many people and put a smile on so many different people's faces. And that's what really made him remarkable. So he's such a great example of why we don't need to necessarily shoot for the stars. Sometimes if we just live each day individually and just in every moment try and be as happy as we can be and bring everyone else around us as happy as they can be too, then that's a beautiful thing. And it's something that we should all try and strive for because I know he did a great job of that too. So I'd like to thank everyone for coming out this year and could we just have a moment of silence to remember Nathan? Thank you.